Huh, Chris. <laughs> A-Hole Productions. Mr. Lee's Welcome probably the in the kitchen getting ready for the party. What about my dog? No problem. But always on a leash and never in a hmm. And done. Oh, wait. It's not done. Uh. Can I just walk back here? <laughs> I don't know if I should do this, but I'm doing it. Oh, I thought I could pull out my camera and take a photo in here, but guess not. Oh well. All right. Oh, I can run this, Peter. I just okay. Press the R two button. Hi, Peter. Hi. Be strong. Oh, that's cool. The daycare. Rather live on the street than ask my parents for help. Dream, hope, believe, dare, risk. I don't know if you could open doors here, but that's oh whoa, what's up? People don't realize how many kids are homeless. One in 30. And too many shelters aren't equipped to care for them. It's neat to see Peter doing, like, something... Much, the gig's a gig. Um, you know, something to help out in his neighborhood. I know Aunt May works here, which I always thought this was a good idea, to have Aunt May... Uh, you know, you're always trying to figure out how to make ways Aunt May and Mary Jane can get involved in stories. Like, whenever you're writing Spider-Man... It's always one of those things where you're like, oh, what do I do? Like, how do I get them involved? Having Aunt May work at a homeless shelter that's run by, you know, like a, a bad guy is kind of neat. It's like, a, it's a cool aspect. Uh, then also gives you opportunity to bring in other characters, like in the comics when they brought in Eddie Brock, which we recently did for episode 250. Everyone feels hopeless um, at some point. Helps to know there's somebody willing to listen. And, uh, it's, yeah, it's just neat. It's, uh, and then like Mary Jane in this one, I think she's like a journalist. So it's, again, trying to get those characters involved um, is uh, not easy. It's not easy to come up with new ways to tell those uh, the same story over and over. Oh. Hey. I know you. Hey, Martin. So sorry I'm late. You were right on time. Just keep her distracted while we get everything ready. You got it. <laughs> hey, there's my favorite aunt. Peter, what a nice surprise. Need some help? Uh, yeah, sure. <laughs> Oh, there are some heavy no, boxes. No, no, no. I mean, I mean, I mean, not yet. I mean, I came to, uh... <laughs> uh I just, just wanted to talk. Okay. Okay. <laughs> um... Peter. Are you in trouble? Do you need money? No, no I, mean, I mean, I'm a little behind on my rent, but... No, 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 I'm, I'm, I'm fine. Girl problems again, huh? What? No, that's crazy. I still wish you and MJ <laughs> could work things out. She's a great girl. She is. The two of you would make some beautiful wow. babies. Uh. Peter. <laughs> what is it? <laughs> Come on. Wow. You tell me. <laughs> that's great. <laughs> years. You helping me through college and working here. Sacrificing so much and asking for nothing. You know, I was talking to a parent the other day the about um, right. the things their kids don't Try realize they do for them. Um, you were inspired by my mission to help. And uh, the dad was like, now it's you. "Thanks for saying." He was like, "Thanks for saying that." I go, "Trust me, I was a bad kid, Thank you, mate. and I didn't appreciate what my mom did for me." And then, as an There's adult, I look serve. back now, luckily with the memory, you know, some of the memories. And realize, you know, you see them from, you see those memories from a different perspective, and you see what parents do for you. So I know, like a lot of people out there, they kind of rebel against their parents. It's it's natural. I was telling the guys like, when your kids get older and they hate Thanks your guts and they say so. nasty things to you, well, I'm like, don't take it more. personally because one well, day they'll grow up too and they'll be parents and they'll everyone. understand and they'll and they'll ask for yeah, they'll, they'll say they're sorry. Hall, <laughs> it's like, man. it's the circle of life. I um, um, thanks again for the party and everything. It, it really means a lot. Voicemail from Yuri. You should check it outside. All right. We run into any familiar faces? Is uh, Eddie Brock in here? That would be cool. Anybody? No? Eddie Brock? Eddie Brock, are you here? 
I'm wondering, because they already made us a reference to the black costume. They kept Uncle Ben's clothes a long time. It's like he was still looking out for her. Oh. Oh, that's kind of sad. Is she giving out his clothes? Oh, she's giving the clothes away. Oh, that's nice. I I could afford an electric wheelchair. Um. Who said that? I was like, I can write things. I was like, oh, is that Eddie Brock? All right, let's go outside. I'm sure there's some Easter eggs in there, but... You know, let's move the story. What's up, Dark Side Effect Studios? How's it going? Welcome to the stream. We had just kind of got back into this. We're about maybe of actual story, probably like you know two hours into the game. Um, we've been doing a lot of side stuff, which is just kind of fun running around New York or swinging around New York. For she's a jolly good fellow. Voicemail from Yuri. Holding Fisk's estate sale just tripped. Uh -oh. Could you check it out quietly? I don't want to make a scene if it's nothing. Fisk estate sale. You got it. Sounds fun. I wonder what the kingpin had hidden in his closet. Look at this. What up? Oh, what up? Uh, I know the thing we got to go to is over there, but uh, I am gonna head over to this tower and dismantle it real quick so that way after we finish some story missions we could do more side quests so these here if you're new to the game they are um... oh, come on we got it there we go uh, if you, every time you hack into one of these it gives spider-man the ability to hack in like to tap into um, the things that are happening in this part of town like wherever you're at so there's like a you know, maybe 20 block or 30 block radius where it shows you, like, the hidden things around. So, like, for example, we got a backpack over here now. Ooh. Whoa, hey! Black cat. Peter, I lost track of you at the party. Yeah, I had to get to the lab. Sorry. Don't apologize. I just wanted to tell you how much what you said meant to me. Oh. I always wonder if I'm doing right by you. Well, stop wondering. After losing my parents and Uncle Ben, there are so many times I would have fallen apart if not for you. Well, that works both ways, Peter. I just wanted to make sure you knew that. May, that I, is a very sweet moment. I don't know what to say. Oh, I think Mr. Lee needs my help. I should go. See you soon, dear. I love you. Love you too. Boom! Backpack with brass knuckles in it. Holy cow. Peter. Flash Thompson must have been one mean bully. Oh, what up? Josie's. Can I take a selfie? Beautiful. How do I take selfies? I saw people posting selfies. Let's keep this episode going. Suit power ready. Quietly. Better find a back way in. All right. Sneaky, sneaky. I think after this mission, though, we might change it up and put on the Scarlet Spider costume and take some selfies around New York. Because, uh... Ah, man, I love that costume. I am losing patience. Where is... Oh. The file. There's someone else here. They must have taken it. Those masks. Who are these guys? Well, Spider-Man, if you no read here but us. Dan Slot's run of your own book, you would know that they're called the you will demons. Die. Inner That's demons? Bad. Or They'll just the demons? Them. Need to pick them off silently. Yeah. Yuri, the silent alarm was legit. Masked gunman and a single hostage. Looks like a heist in progress. 
Copy that. Sending units your way. Keep the situation from getting worse in the meantime. Can do. Hmm. Ah, I love the Scarlet Spider suit too. Also the Ben Riley suit. Yeah. Yeah, I like the Ben Riley suit a lot. It's a good one. Yikes. Gotta do this quietly. Don't want to alert the others. Hold L2 to aim at the floor. To fire web shooter. Nice. Oh, I love that takedown. We did one of those earlier. That was good times. Uh, this game is set in a time which Peter has been Spider-Man for some time, right? Yeah, I think he's been... Um, get behind an enemy for a stealth takedown. I think Peter has been Spider-Man for like a couple years at the, uh, the start of the storyline. I can't remember if it's like 8 or 10. Um, I don't think it's... Maybe it's 6? I can't remember. Maybe 6. Yeah, but he's been Spider-Man for a few years now. Um, so he's kind of like, you know, gotten good at things. Someone's coming. They'll see me down here. My patience wears thin. Someone else is here. I swear. She must have the file. She. If they're here, where are all right That's awesome. Nice. Nice. I thought I ran too far into him and he was going to get alerted. But... Oh, what's that? Hey, a camera. This totally belongs to... Don't move. Uh-oh. Buddy, if I had a nickel for every don't move... Mary Jane Watson. Yeah. Oh, what's up, John? Welcome hey, back. Uh, speaking what of which, what you drinking? You. Oh, snap. At least Two fur. Was. Uh, oh, I, uh, um, the rules of the down. game are I have to wait for John Lee to enter the chat we before someone can ask people. what's everyone drinking tonight. Uh, and I'm sorry I got you a second time, John. That was a cheap shot, but you got to, I got to take victories when I can get them. Um, the music is good in this game, though. You're right. Very, very much so. Fifteen minutes earlier. Flashback! That was a good introduction to her. Nice reveal. He's like, this camera totally belongs to... And then she, like, knocks that dude out. Uh, Rosemans. I think me. that's, uh... Hi. Mary I think Jane Bill Watson, Roseman is one of the people I Hello. think I follow him on Twitter. He worked on this game. I like to get a jump on things. So I think that was a little nod to him. Well, I don't. You'll have to come back tomorrow. Right. Wow. Okay. I'm sorry. Hey, Craig? No, sorry. It just... It looks like we're gonna have to run something else on the cover. I don't know. Uh, maybe the expressionist piece? <laughs> you know what? I think I can make today work. Sure. You're here. No moment like the present. Thank you. Craig? <laughs> Never mind. 
We're good. Let's get started. Well played, Mary Jane. <laughs> oh, we're, we're actually Mary Jane. I'll be waiting by the Baku statue when you're ready to begin. Can do. We got it. What up? I get why Peter does it, but I never totally loved the heroes hiding behind masks thing. Feels like part of being a hero is standing behind your actions. Being willing to say, yeah, that was me. That's the sort of hero I'd want to be, at least. Well, for we foreshadowing? You don't want to wear a mask? What? Don't you know why Peter does, man? She hasn't had an... She hasn't, like, lost an Uncle Ben, that's why. Alright, I'm a pretty boring camera taker, but... Uh, or photo taker, but... But she doesn't swing like Peter does. <laughs> he saw himself in this. A great man willing to do what others wouldn't. Dude had no self-awareness. He doesn't. And we don't like people without self-awareness. Music reminds me a bit of the Avengers 1 theme. Yeah, right? It has a little bit of that going on. Katana from the 14th century. This cut Peter open like a pork sausage with this the first time they fought. He got away, collapsed in my yard half dead, and I had to steal my dad's car to drive him to the ER. Wow. The first of many Nurse MJ moments. I bet she got tired of that. Yeah, sounds like she didn't like stitching up her boyfriend. Hmm. Oh, rolled cigars. Simcaria. Weren't they just in the news? Yeah, Simcaria. That's uh, where Silver Sable's from, I think. Redheaded Bay, Sometimes right? Sometimes I feel like the whole history of the world is just... Boys playing dress up, getting into fights. Yeah, so. <laughs> MJ, you say that like it's a bad thing. Ooh, did I just. Oh, I broke that glass, didn't I? Yikes. Sorry. The Wilson Fist Collection. Also, hmm. Fisk got a uh, got some pretty good taste, man. I can't wait to see. I don't know if you guys saw the actor um, who plays him in Daredevil, uh, Vincent D'Onofrio. He just tweeted uh, today. Um, he was saying something like, "Oh, I wish I could." Uh, so beautiful. I wish I could tell you guys about season three of Daredevil. We're filming it right now. He's like, but I, I can't. <laughs> um, and I can't wait for that season. Vanessa? Because where we last... Oh. Sounds good. What? That's his wife's... Oh, no way. That's his wife's... Uh, for those who don't know, Vanessa in the comics... I know she's alive on the TV show. They sent her away like to another country. But in the comics, she died. Um, and uh, it becomes a topic in the uh, Dead No More oh, clone conspiracy storyline. So tacky. But uh, anyway, Vincent D'Onofrio, he's going to be in Daredevil Season 3, obviously. What happened to Daredevil, we don't know. He assume, presumably died at the end of uh, Defenders, if you haven't seen that show. Um, he's presumed, presumed dead. So... Uh, I'm curious to see what they're going to do, how they're going to bring him back, what they're going to, you know, figure out. And uh, also, I think Bullseye is going to be in season three. So I'm very excited. Because I like seasons one and two of Daredevil very much. Yeah, he's a fave, right, John? Yeah, D'Onofrio is amazing as Kingpin. I liked his episode with him and Punisher in season two. That was really good. A one of a kind Kake Monbaku. Beautiful. It's a Mifune? Correct. Mr. Fisk has exceptional taste. Did you know him cool. well before his arrest? In a professional context. I handled many of his sales. Let's move mm. on, please. What's this lady's name? Hmm. Now this exquisite piece exemplifies the traditional Tarashikomi puddled ink effect. Get your arm out of the frame. So imposing. I can see why Fisk liked this piece. Definitely his style. Okay. He loved the duo. Ah, uh, her arm, her arm got in frame a little bit. Screams, but creation Dang it. toils in silence. 
Was there ever anything irregular in any of the sales you handled for him? No. No, of, of course not. Hmm. Not that I was aware of. All right. This defensive? What's in here? Notice the intricate gold inlay on this ceremonial tea set. It's just a friend in the DA's office mentioned that Fisk used art sales to launder stolen goods. I'm sure I wouldn't know anything about that. Oh, I know. <laughs> I was just wondering, now that he's arrested, if you had ever noticed anything strange. You know what? I'm actually running short of time. Why don't we I knew we were... photo while we can? When I told yeah. my DA friend I was doing a piece on you, he mentioned your name was familiar. Just uh -oh. the photo, please. Stand right there. Are you sure there's nothing you'd like to say, maybe off the record, regarding Fisk's activities? I don't think your readers would have any interest in... Uh-oh. What is happening? Wait here, please. Wait. I recognize that statue. I've got to get a photo. That shouldn't... Is that it? Craig, I'll call you back. What is that? My dear, I think it's time for you to go. Oh, um, could I use the restroom real quick? Fine. Follow me. Thank you. This, this is a really lovely space. It is. And this will be the last time you see it. The ladies is around the corner. Be quick. Of course. Be right oh, back. Oh, wow. She is a, she's a piece of work. Is that Vanessa? Is she Vanessa? Wait, oh, okay. Over here. <gasps> All right. Hello, Craig. Funny you should call. Because the reporter you sent is clearly not working the puff piece we agreed upon. Uh-oh. No, she's here now. I've got to get into that back room. If that statue is what I think it is, it's just turned into a huge story. What do you mean you have to be scheduled? If she's not your reporter, who is she, Craig? When people are suspicious, we'll appear and they will investigate you see when you've been spotted. Okay. In my auction house. Oh my god. No, I do not trust you to fix this. Uh oh. Well, the first thing I'm going to do is have Miss Investigative Journalist arrested. And the second thing I'm going to do is collect your head, Craig. Dang, she's pissed. It is most definitely a threat. Whew. Uh huh. Sure, Craig. Get me in here, yo. Pete told me about this. Fisk used it to hide evidence. Why did the cops take it? I know this statue opens, but how? Let's see. Oh, she is Vanessa. Behind them, but it looks different. Maybe, maybe it's Vanessa. Is she Vanessa? Let's take this one. That's it. Yes. We done did it. Devil's breath. Devil's breath. Norman Osborn. What is devil's? Uh oh. What the? Oh snap. Oh, this. Uh, that's right. Fifteen minutes early. It took us twenty minutes Excuse to do the fifteen me, minutes earlier thing. You. You can't be. Oh. Not good. You just hit Kingpin's Where's girl, dude. In, in, in there. Uh oh. Find the file. Mary Jane's got it. Jackpot. I was on my way. I love that we get to be MJ too, right? 
that episode in season two of is one of the best of the show in my opinion super good scenes yeah when kingpin is like manipulating frank castle yeah that was really good stuff but you know with kingpin if he gets out in season three okay um he better i hope that means we're gonna punish her appearance because you know punisher wants to get his hands on fisk after being manipulated in that episode yeah you too not exactly how i pictured us meeting again though Honey, it's exactly how I pictured it. Man, yeah, I know she's annoyed. Did she change her but... perfume? Focus, Pete, focus. <laughs> um, I know he's, uh... Yes, oh. all right, of course. Should clear these guys out before I push forward. Ah, there we go. Did he say Martha? He said, "Ooh, Martha." Man, this got a lot of stuff. Nice. All right. So we got some stealthing going on here. Oh. Uh, oh, Jesus! Wow, we screwed that up. Wow. Let me go. We we saved it. <laughs> we we screwed it up and then we saved it. Oh god, dang. Really a punch in the back of the head? No. Hide. Not cool with the hostage taking guys. Oh. Whoa! What is up with that glowy stuff on your hands? Are you guys ghosts? Never fought a ghost before. They do have glowy stuff on their hands. I mean, I've fought specters, but you know, technically specters aren't ghosts. All ghosts are specters, but not all specters are ghosts. You know what I mean? <laughs> all right. We got everyone? Oh, what up? This dude's got like an axe of glowiness. Do you guys know Thor? Whoa! Ow. I guess, uh... I guess those axes aren't so tough after all. And finisher. Boom. Good night. Cool. Anybody else want to F with Shady? No? Okay. Come on, I'm dodging! <laughs> Ow! Heal, heal, heal. Jerk face. Keep healing, out. keep healing, Pete. Oh, thank goodness. What's up with the script? script uh, the, sub, 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 the subscription, dude. Huh. Ouch! I am sure that is going to leave a mark. Absolutely. <laughs> stealth is my fave, so liking this part. Oh, you like stealth stuff? Sweet. I wasn't sure. Um. Awesome. Well then, this is, it's fun. Resub hype. I think if you know what I, I wish I would have told you this because I mentioned it earlier. I didn't know you were going to do that. <laughs> um. I think. Subs, if, so I'll tell everybody else then. Uh, if you sub starting on September 10th, it's only a dollar. Uh, it's it's a fi it's the the tier one subscription, but only for one dollar. They're doing like a special. I got the notification today on Twitch. So I was saying it earlier, but I didn't get you in time. I'm so sorry. But uh, thanks for the sub in the shower, uh, and thanks for the thanks for the the tier one sub. We have a new emoji coming for the tier one sub. That um, that uh, OK Cunning was nice enough to offer to help me with. So I have a picture already. I'm going to send it to him, and that'll be the new sub. It'll be my face as Venom uh, from uh, PJ's artwork from my Venom vlog show. Uh, so that'll be coming very, very soon. Um, so you'll have that. I'll make sure you guys have that as, as soon as possible. I'm going to send that image to OK Cunning today 
so that he has it and he's going to help manipulate it a little bit to uh, fit into an emoji format so yeah so thank you dude thank you, you for this the the resub no idea but i'm still glad to make these fries totally best in city so how's the grind with the bugle this story this episode had a lot of story in it so uh yeah, it'll well, be interesting to edit this try to get it down to half an hour so uh, but i will so i'll make it work meeting with a legal team i knew about the Again. dollar thing but it's cool i wanted to make Seems sure i did it oh that's right? nice of you dude i appreciate it very very much so, You'll have another super chat coming from me next time I catch you live. I've been watching you live on, but just on my phone. Um, your theory chats. I'm usually at work on Sundays, uh, but I try to catch you the best I can. Uh, but unfortunately, I can't do any super chats or anything on my phone because I have a dumb Windows phone. Which, by the way, next Friday I won't anymore. Uh, I get paid next Friday, and I I'm gonna get a free upgrade on a phone. But at least I'll have some money in case, like you know, if I need to buy extra things like phone cases, things like that. So. Next week I'll have a. Almost sounds like it's more important than your other job. A phone that'll. Uh, I've never heard you talk like that before. Oh. A lot can change in six months. Uh, it'll be nice to have a phone where I can actually do stuff and interact more with. Here, with. Um, oh, just uh, just dinner between. This is friends. sweet. Friends. Mm -hmm. Is that what we are? Yeah, maybe we could be. You know, if, if, if that's what you wanted. There's a lot of baggage here. Yeah, sure, but is that so bad? I mean, baggage can carry good things too, like uh, <laughs> like money and uh, keys, <laughs> raspberry lip balm. Do you remember why we broke up? No, this I'm is new to this game. Saved by the siren. Talk to you later. Go. Cool. I see. Yeah, she still likes him, but I'm guessing they broke up because of Spider-Man stuff. Love seeing you two together. Again. No way! Always were my favorites. Oh, what a sweet cameo! That almost brings a tear to my nerdy eye. That is, uh, that is very sweet. This open window can lead somewhere or nowhere. It's up to you. What do you mean, who is this? It's Chris. Why won't you believe me?